Everyone seemed to be so underwhelmed by what they showcased at Minecraft Live. However, we have already seen a shift and now it seems like a lot of people are adequately hyped for Minecraft 1.20. What else could the update have in store? Here's 6 ideas that I think would greatly improve 1.20. It's cool to see a new mob head and the new functionality to mob heads. But hopefully the piglin head won't be the last mob head we'll be getting in 1.20 update. If we were to get any more, it probably wouldn't be a pass of mobs. So I think the one that would fit best would be an enderman head. In this short right here, I provided some ideas to improve on the 1.20 update, just like I am in this video. And since two of the four suggestions have been added, I think the other two ideas would be great too. That being, we should be able to have text be visible on both sides of the hanging sign, and allow camels to spawn anywhere in the desert, not just villages. You know what else spawns in villages? villages. And currently there are two villager textures that do not have a corresponding village type, the jungle villager and the swamp villager. And now that we have both bamboo wood and mangrove wood, and the mud blocks, perhaps it's finally time to add in the jungle and swamp village. My skin used to be a very blatant Grian knockoff, and to repent for my skins of the past, I have renamed myself to Grian knockoff on my discord server, link in the description down below until I reach 400 subscribers. So please, free me of my skins from the past and help me hit 400 subscribers by hitting that subscribe button down below. Mojang said they wanted this to be the self-expression update or whatever, so you know what could be cool? What if we could change our skin from inside the game without having to leave your world or server? It would be a great package deal with the new defaults. Speaking of skins, you probably knew that there are certain names you can use on mobs to change their skin or models, such as Dinnerbone making them upside down, Jeb making a sheep rainbow coloured, or Toast making a rabbit into this skin. I think it would fit right into 1.20 to add more easter eggs like this, perhaps including a Technoblade name for the pig applying a crown, name a pig Earth makes it muddy to pay homage to Minecraft Earth, or naming a Mooshroom Bloom makes it a Moo Bloom. You may struggle to remember back to the biome vote from years ago. We were introduced to fancier cactuses. I think it would be really cool to bring these back, and perhaps the fruit could act as a temporary power-up for the camels, making them faster. Or, perhaps we just need a power-up in our fashion. Which is why I think it would be cool to add some sort of customization to the elytra. Perhaps by combining the elytra with certain items in the smithing table, such as the dragon head to make them dragony, or an emerald to make them look vexy, we could finally have something nicer than a greyish purple blob. Watch this video right here to see some ideas I had for the 2023 mob vote, and this video right here to see this really funny green ripoff of whom I absolutely don't know personally. If you made it till the end, comment, turtles are pretty gnarly. Hope you enjoyed, bye!